Now you can view the marketing automation results for individual contacts within your Act database. In this video, I want to show you how to use the marketing automation tab on the detail view for any of your Act contacts. Let me start by locating a contact who has interacted with my campaigns, assets, or landing pages in the past. His name is Charlie Jones. So once I've located his record and gone to his detail view, let's locate the marketing automation tab below and click it. On this tab, you're going to see three sections, send email, campaigns, and scores. The send email section lets you author and send one-off emails to this contact directly from this tab. Let me do that real quick. Let's invite Charlie to lunch. I'll type in lunch next weekend. And then for the body of the email, let's just say, hello, Charlie. Are you interested in lunch next weekend? And now I'll click send email. I get a verification that this email was sent to Charlie. And if I go to my history tab, I should see that a history item has been created for this email. Back on the marketing automation tab, also in the send email section, you can import your marketing automation templates as a one-off email to a contact. Next up, we have the campaigns area, and this lets you add individual contacts to any of your campaigns in Act Marketing Automation. By doing this, you're gonna bypass the groups or inclusion list processes if you just wanna add one person to a campaign. To do this, select the campaign from the list and then click the Add to Campaign button. Down below, you can even see which campaigns this contact currently belongs to. Finally, in the Scores area, this will display the marketing automation score for individual contacts based upon the scoring profiles that you've set up. Charlie currently has a score of three, which he earned by clicking a link in one of my email campaigns. This score will increase as he interacts with any campaigns, assets, web activity, or landing pages that I've set up in my scoring rule profiles.